So I keep seeing this challenge on YouTube, which is I only ate blank for a certain amount of time. And the only thing is, most of these challenges are a bit... Uh, meh. So I thought I'd make it my duty to do the best version of one of these challenges, the challenge everyone needs, which is only eating edibles for an entire week. Why not only eat edibles for an entire week? Every single bit of food I eat should be medicated for a week. Now, I'm not actually going to do it for a whole week because I feel like that might mess me up a bit. But I'm going to do it from Monday to Thursday. So four full days only eating medicated meals. So today is Monday. I've just woken up. I haven't eaten anything yet and it's 12 o'clock. So I think we need to get this started. Let me show you guys what I've got for the week to eat. Inside here is uh, my nice shopping bag. Um, <laughs> right? <laughs> uh, very nice, Waitrose, when did you step your game up, man? So this is everything for the week. Before we get into this, quick message from our sponsor of the day, VoIPScan. If you ever want to advertise any of your services, you can do so with VoIPScan. They have some of the most favorable conditions in the marketplace. They have over 100,000 people available to watch your ads, and they have a really flexible customer targeting system. You can set a fee for one viewing of the video, and you get a personal convenient account where you can view your statistics very easily. The minimum amount to get going is $80, and for a limited time, they're going to be doubling your money. So every time you add $80, they're actually going to give you $160. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, and you want to advertise your services through them, the link will be in the description. And even just rating them, going on the website and just checking them out, it really does the channel some good because it brings traffic to them. So cheers, guys, for supporting the sponsors. This is, uh, this is the goal right now. <laughs> uh, let's go through what we've got here, why I've got it, and how I think it's going to be sustainable for the week. So uh, we've got a chocolate bar right here, 200 milligram. Uh, we've got a uh, brownie. We've got brownie, 120 milligram. We've got uh, some truffles, which is 60 milligram of truffle. we got another brownie we got another brownie we got this one which i'm pretty sure is in a different style but uh, it's another brownie nonetheless we also got some more truffles and then uh i forget what's in here i forget what's in here this was made up for me uh like literally yesterday so i, I kind of forgot what's in there maybe that would be uh, an interesting thing to find out obviously if i just ate stuff like this for the whole week uh that would not be very good for nutritional value and uh would probably take its toll on me so uh we've also got this barbecue sauce which is 555 milligrams uh, I've got some chocolate syrup, 555 milligrams, and I've got another two of them, so that way I can go a bit ham. And we've also got this drink right here, uh, which is like a THC drink, so I can add that into my drinks, make sure absolutely everything I consume for a week is medicated. And uh, I think this is gonna work. This is the goal, I saw about the mess, but I mean, let's do it. I think I'm just gonna document myself every time I eat something. When I feel really, really stoned, I'm gonna document what's going on as well. Uh, I'm probably still gonna be doing live streams throughout the week, so if any of you guys are lucky enough to catch them, that'd be pretty good. But uh, I guess we're just gonna see how it goes and uh, see uh, what this does to me, I guess. <laughs> let's do it. So it's currently around 2, 2 p.m. and it's already making me realize how bad my eating habits are anyway. I mean, I ate loads yesterday night, but I'm only just kind of hungry and I really need a drink as well. And I, I will admit, I woke up this morning and I accidentally just drank a straight glass of water, which won't happen in the future. Like, I'm gonna, look, everything is gonna be medicated here. Uh, so, uh, I need some water and I also think I need some food. Ah, it actually tastes kind of just like water. Maybe like bulvic water. You know when you get bulvic water? Ah, this is going to be a nice week. <laughs> it's got edible gold. It's got edible gold on it. Started editing, and all I've been doing is getting the footage onto my computer. And I'm already starting to feel a little bit lit. And I feel like I need to slow down, but I also need another glass of water because I just ate the brownie and it made my mouth really dry. So uh, I'm going to drink another water, but I'm going to make it really, really light. I've just finished editing this thing. It is now four o'clock and I definitely need some real food, like some actual food rather than just some snacks. Uh, so I'm gonna fucking make myself some. I've made myself some bacon, some waffles and some sausages. The most healthy meal you could ever have, mate. Um, but I've got some barbecue sauce here on the side. I'm gonna dip the stuff in it and eat it and uh, see how it goes. I'm, I'm literally just trying this little tiny bit first so I can see what it's like. Okay, it just tastes like barbecue sauce. <laughs> I've got some more on here now. Uh, oh, I drew some of my shirt. Fuck. 
Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's nice. Second day, just woken up, and I uh, made myself a barbecue cheese and ham toasty, which uh, yeah, this is gonna be nice. I think this is gonna be nice. Mmm, this is dangerously nice. Like this tastes really, really nice. I'm like, I'm really scared about what's gonna happen to me later today because I'm gonna eat a lot of this fucking sauce. Mmm. This tastes amazing. Hi, right, we're here. Yes, yes. Farley Vlogs here. What are you saying? Right, we're in London, and I, so, right, I ate the, uh, ate the brownie on the train, had a Sprite, and I also ate some other bits and bobs during the day. I had like a truffle, uh, and every, every bit of water be I've been rocked, having, I put my lean in it. <laughs> be rocked, yeah, it's bro. mad. And if you want to see exactly where we are, like just so you know how central London we are right now, that is the London Eye. So, zone one. Zone uh, one. yeah, for Charlie's channel, we're going around and we're doing a drunk versus high video. Uh, if you want to go watch that after this, yeah, the yeah. link will be in the description. But uh, for the time being, I think I'm just going to go with him. Every time he drinks, I'm going to have a panini with some edible barbecue sauce on the top of it. Yes. And, uh, Let's get spanded. Oh yeah, shit, I ate my toasty for breakfast this morning with bare barbecue sauce on it as well. <laughs> Bro. Right, Fuck let's go. Hell. Right, so we're going over where South Bank Skate Park is. Uh, maybe maybe I should skate at South Bank sometime because I've never uh, I've never actually skated South, South Bank. Bank. Yeah, we know, I know where I'm going. Look, he's already fucking drunk as fuck and I'm just chilling. <laughs> Look at this dude. Oh shit, what you Look saying? at that feed, bro. Oh, so the last time I went on a tube, right? I can't, oh, mate, I, I literally don't remember. I know I've been on a tube since the time I'm thinking about, but I like, I just don't remember it. You're just a driver. I'm you a know, driver I'm not gonna lie, if I drove, you think you'd see me on a tube? Oi, shut up, I'm talking. We can't have the next station is Charing Cross. That last tube scene could have made it look like Casey Neistat, but <laughs> I mean, I'm glad I don't look like Casey Neistat. So, uh, I mean, so what's the plan here, my man? Right, so we're gonna go into a web spoons. Yeah. We're gonna hopefully get in with our bottle of narcotics. And uh, <laughs> if they don't let us in, well, what are we gonna do? We're gonna go to the next web spoons. Yeah, we go to the next one, and, and then we go to the next one, and we go to the next one. This way, this way. <laughs> you know I mean? Oh, you're the funniest fucking cunt, right, I swear. Here we go. Bloody 50. Right beside us. We've got the 50. Bloody hell. I don't. <laughs> Wait, they, they flashed their lights, please, bro. <laughs> please, don't arrest me. I've not got anything on me, officer. <laughs> Into that last service spin chair and we couldn't get in right, but it's literally just because they don't allow skin fades in there. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> nah, for real, they didn't have any seats, so we're gonna find one which hopefully has some seats. Um, down here, down here! Montague Pike. Montague the Pike. Slash best weather spoons in the land. <laughs> well, let's fucking hope it is, bro. Let's fucking hope. <laughs> in for about five, ten minutes for a seat. We finally got one. Yes, Montague Pike. You're absolutely smashing it. So we're gonna chill. We're gonna get a little bit of food, a little bit of uh, drinky poos, a little bit of alcohol. Drew's gonna obviously put his uh, my barbecue sauce, secret, uh, 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 my barbecue best barbecue, sauce. best barbecue yeah, yeah. sauce in the world, onto his food, and we're gonna do the drunk versus high challenge. Yeah, you ready? So, can I just point out, so we, we actually did manage to make it into a Weatherspoons, right? Just about. Just, yeah, but just can about. I just, can I just point out that my man here is like, yeah, yeah, it's the biggest Weatherspoons, it's gonna have seats, it's gonna have loads of seats, bro, it's gonna have loads of seats. Look at this, yeah. We, we, this, we were so lucky to get the seat we're in right now. Okay, right, right, can I just say, but have we got seats? 
Yeah, yeah we, do, we, we do, we do. We have a seat. Yeah. We have a seat. We have a seat. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. I told you. Right? I told you. This is going to be the one, okay? What's on this menu here? Look, what are you gonna get? Can I can I close my eyes and pick something for you? <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Bro, <laughs> look, I don't need a drink. Look, can I I've can, got my drink? Can I close my eyes, yeah, and pick something for you from this? Yeah, go on then. Alright, hold the camera. Like, show, wait, show, wait, wait, show hang on, hang on. on. Right. Let me just uh Okay, look, let me get to a page pass, where, where I'll actually Okay, like where you can have anything, anything, yeah, anything. Yeah, anything. Right, anything. Right. You don't want it to have bottles of wine on it, bro. You don't want it to have bottles of wine on it. Uh, this is kind of shit. I'm not gonna lie. Let's let's get to the actual. What outcome. what what's he doing? That was that was the thing. All right. Go on. Go oh, this, for it. This shot right here. What? Anything? Anything off of here? Right, I'm have one hand like this, yeah. Yeah yeah. Go on. Oh. What is it? A Guinness! Is... Guinness! <laughs> Come on! Wait, show, camera, show, camera, show my camera, it's not in it. <laughs> Might have to zoom in because it's on fish eye, innit? Yeah. Did that work? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, man's ordered me the Guinness. <laughs> right, so I'm thinking I get the barbecue one, mainly because then when I put my barbecue sauce in it, you won't like change the taste exactly. or anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah exactly. Just, just a little squirt on top. It, down it, down it, down it. Down it? Are you joking, bro? I'll give you five quid if you down it. Bro, you owe me more than five <laughs> quid for the meal. What do you mean? <laughs> down it. You, bro, this is like a fifth of the way drunk. No way. Five quid's five quid, right? Uh, Ten up. No, I'll, I'll, give you a, I'll give you a tenner for the meal as well. <laughs> so I actually be giving you like 466 for down in it. Alright. <laughs> no way, he's actually dead. <laughs> Why did you Fair do play. that, bro? Come on. Yes, I won it. I won it. I think that's calm for the one. Choo! And then I'm a. Uh... Oh. 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 Right. And then I'm a. Uh... Cheese! If I had some like pure isolate CBD, I'd be like. <laughs> <laughs> Salt Bay. <laughs> I've downed the whole Guinness, and I'm not gonna lie, I regret it. It wasn't great. It really wasn't. Bruv, tell him, look, tell him to look at my face. Tell me, was it horrible? Look, this is a face of a guy after downing a Guinness. Charlie's gone for his first piss of the night. I'm here. Try, uh, chowing down on my food. I don't feel as lit as I was yesterday. Yesterday I was eating like loads and loads of little bits of food, like 50 milligrams here, 100 milligrams there. So I was like constantly at this point like all day. But today I had like one big one and then like another big one rather than like, so like I feel it and then it comes down and I feel it and it comes down rather than it just being like consistent, whoa. So uh, yeah, feel it better today. Hey yo. We outside. We're off to uh, bank. where are we off to? Bank. 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 We're off to bank, bro. Uh, so this is uh, tube number two. Hold on, I need to get my ticket out. Charlie, mate. If you got breathalyzer right now and you're in a car, what would happen? Now, you may, you may think I'm over the limit. Just, just a little. I'm over the limit. Fully. I'm very. <laughs> oh, fuck it Another bet for you, man. Five quid if you can run up this wall and then over there and then all the way back around this way. I, I mean, there's just there's just no chance. <laughs> oh shit, mate! Have you seen this ad? It's for Shane Dawson's makeup palette. <laughs> what a pile of shit. My hiccups are so bad. 
Where'd they go? Oh, just wait. Nah, they're gone because they they're gone. Energy, bro. <laughs> Oh my god, they're gone! Yeah! Fuck, wait, you've seen how many people on this train? What's going on? <laughs> what happened? What happened? It was the Guinness. The Guinness? It wasn't the Guinness. Brother, threw up in the toilet. Yeah, but like, you, you don't you win. <laughs> okay, you win. You win, okay? You, you can handle weight way more than I can handle alcohol. Okay. Wait, um, you see win. this straight line right here, yeah? Slow walking. Yeah, 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 with your toes and everything, right? Come on, mate, come on, mate, come on, mate. Come on, mate! Oh. Mate, you got hey. it! You got it. <laughs> come on! I'm just going to say that, you win. What are we doing now, then? You win. You know what we're gonna do now? We're gonna smoke a big fucking doobie is what? And we're gonna go home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like this stuff, I'm gonna... There was one time, I can't remember what year this was. That's probably about five years ago. This, this bridge, and that little thing, right there, right? I was like, it was, it, was, it might have been like five in the morning. There were no trains. I was at like some mad party. And I was with like two people who also needed to go to Waterloo. And we were just walking around trying to have some fun until we got there. And uh, we, we went there and we were just chilling. And there were two other guys there. And then like, after like, we were chilling in for like five minutes, they were like, you come if we smoke some weed? And we were like, if we can smoke some, yeah. And literally we were just chonging for like an hour. Just sat there. It was so cool. Really nice experience. It was fucking sick. And I feel so creative right now. Like I was chatting with Charlie about a few things. And it's totally different to yesterday. Yesterday I felt like a fucking slug. Today I feel like, I feel like I could do so many fucking bits of work. I, could, I feel like I could plan out so much fucking good shit for the channel. So many cool things to do. Yeah, I'm definitely uh, feeling the creative vibe right now. I've seen so many amazing skate spots during this walk and I'm, I'm like not even really close to where I'm going. And yeah, it feels really nice. I fucking love walking around London. I have an hour until my train. I have a little bit of this left. Ah. Yeah. I'm just gonna wander around because I'm already here and uh, I guess I can wander for a bit. Um, yeah, no tobacco in yeah, it. Yeah, yeah fuck that. Train, Literally, this mate is fucking just bumped into me on the street, in it. I'm just oh, yeah, walking yeah, along man. trying to kill time. <laughs> I actually can't believe it's him, bro. So it's day three. Uh, whoa, I woke up this morning. Mad dry mouth. I mean, like, I was so dehydrated. I'm pretty sure it's because I've been putting THC in every single drink that I've been having. I'm gonna give myself some leeway. I had a, a proper glass of water this morning, and I'm gonna, every, every other drink I have is gonna be weed infused. So I think that still works, and I'm gonna have toasty uh it is already like one o'clock or something but i just finished off a video for today uh yeah so i'm gonna eat my first bit of food see how i feel a bit later i'm gonna not skimp out on this toasty as well i'm gonna put uh enough in <laughs> is that is that too much cheese it doesn't look quite like too much cheese i don't know i, had, I didn't wash the grater last night because i was too stoned so yeah it'll be fine it'll be fine Ah. <laughs> ah. Well, it's a good thing I have another one of these. <laughs> Attempt number two. <laughs> I swear, I make the most banging toasties ever. A bit fell out of it, but I put it back on top because I'm still going to eat it. But still, look. Banging. So I didn't really feel myself eating too much this day, and truth be told, I didn't really eat that much. I ate uh, some more of the candies, like I ate another brownie and some truffles, and then I also had like a dinner for the night with some barbecue sauce on it, but I mainly just went out and skated for the day, and that was kind of how I spent uh, that day. Yo. So we're on the last day of only eating edibles for a week, and I must say, 
I felt very slow all week, if you haven't been able to tell. But today, I felt very, very creative. I woke up and I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get on it. I'm gonna do all this fucking stuff that I've wanted to do for ages. Uh, yeah, so I ended up getting, oh, if I can unlock the van. Right, so I ended up getting this uh, sofa for the van which now means there is no bed in here like there used to be. There is just a sofa. How do I show this properly on camera? This is a sofa bed, sofa type thing. It folds out, it goes all the way to the back. Uh, that way I have lots more room in here during the day. Got a little seat there. Uh, maybe I could put in another one of those little seats or something, but I've got extra cushions under here for if people want to sit in the in the van. How do I? Uh, look, there we go. I've got extra cushions to pull out if people want to sit in the van. Um, yeah. Oh, this looks amazing. This looks this looks so good. I'm I'm really glad I was on this today. If there's one thing that I've noticed is that my eating habits are really bad. I mean, I didn't get to eat everything that I would normally eat, right? Because you can't add barbecue sauce and chocolate sauce onto absolutely everything that you eat. But uh, it's been going pretty well. So uh, final day. Maybe we should get some fast food. Put some stuff on the fast food. Ways. My order is wrong. Sad. So I've definitely learned a few things during this week. I mean, the first thing is that it's damn easy to medicate all of your meals. It's just you're probably not going to be able to eat absolutely everything that you actually want to eat. And then the second thing is, oh my god, never try and put THC in every single one of your drinks because you'll end up having the worst dry mouth of all time. So on a more serious note, if there's one thing I have properly learned, it's that edibles with me have kind of one of two effects. They're either going to make me really, really creative or they're going to make me feel like an absolute slug. And I still, after this project, don't actually know why one happens when one doesn't because I pretty much ate the same food and the same drinks every single day and I just had different effects every day. So um, yeah, edibles and my body definitely are a weird one. Uh, safe one guys make sure you check out the sponsor of the stream their stuff will be linked in the description And if you enjoyed this video make sure you smash a like on it Dislike it if you didn't and if you want to see more vloggy type stuff like this with challenges and stuff Let me know in the comments below safe one guys in a bit